$1.25 million. That's how much it cost to fix damage to Hilton Head Island Middle School after it was vandalized last month. Crews have been working to get it all cleaned up before the first day of school. Ryan Tismaneski talked to school district officials about that process. There were two incidents of vandalism in July at Hilton Head Island Middle School, which is currently under construction for renovations. School district leaders say people entered the school and spray painted some areas, but the major cause of damage was spraying fire extinguishers across campus. You know, I, I don't even think the vandals realized how big a problem they caused by what was done in here. The company responsible for cleaning the damage valued the costs at $1.25 million, which was verified by the school district's insurance. The district's deductible is $50,000 of taxpayer money. The main source for the high cleanup costs was the use of fire extinguishers. The chemicals from them entered air vents, spreading heavy metals throughout the building, which could not be cleaned with water. So the best way I heard described is that it's like having a fire without a fire. Um, because the material from the fire extinguishers got spread throughout the building because of the HVAC system. Cleaning the damage was rigorous and it was completed ahead of schedule in less than two weeks. Odding says the halls were lined with HEPA filters for vacuuming. The building was wiped three times over and the air conditioning ducts and coils had to be cleaned. All this went on during renovation construction. Odding commends everyone involved in the cleanup. This building has been cleaned cleaned again and then cleaned again. So um, it is, as far as cleanliness, it's in good shape and we're ready for everyone to come back. Thanks to the quick cleanup, Hilton Head Island Middle School will welcome students back next Monday. On Hilton Head Island, Ryan Tismaneski, WTOC News.